here. Yeah, we've got the Blue Jays, Joel, and the Rays, and Kevin Gosman. He has been worth the money so far for Toronto. No doubt about it, but I, I'll say this is the two leaders in fan graphs war for starting pitchers this year. Gosman's one. Carlos Rodon is two. Mm. He's the guy who replaced Gosman in San Francisco. I would say it's a sign that the Giants know what they're doing when it comes to starting pitching because their starting pitching besides Rodon is excellent again this year. What, what does Gosman do so well where he's, I mean, basically, we always knew he had the stuff, but the last few years he has really put it together. Yeah, I mean, he's put it together with that combination of the fastball and the splitter. But what he does so well is tunnel those pitches. I mean, when, you got, when you're able to throw your fastball for strikes like he is and, and bring in a splitter and slider combination with that, He's able to keep the same arm action and the same release point on, on both. And that is the way you get the swings and misses that he does on the splitter. I mean, this thing's just falling off a table. But the only way you get guys to swing at that splitter going out of the zone is if it's in the same plane as that fastball. And you got to be able to keep the same arm action and the same arm speed. Because once there's a slight difference in that between your fastball and your off speed, you can see right here between the fastball, the splitter, and the slider, it's the same arm angle. It's, it's the same release point. Yep. And he keeps that arm speed at, at, this, at the same going through, as you see here in, in, this, in this little breakdown, as far as which, how the pitches are going to break off the plane. But with that same arm speed, it gets the hitter off balance. And, the re, and it's one of the reasons why he gets the swings and misses he does on the, on the split finger. And if there's a slight difference, those hitters will be able to pick that up and be able to you know, take that splitter because he doesn't throw it for strikes all that often. It's mainly a swing and miss pitch, but that's what makes him so difficult to hit. And I didn't have much success off him, but I know my approach with him was I, I wanted to stay off that splitter. Right. I wanted to stay on the I, I wanted to stay on the heater up. I almost fa I almost like approached him as I would a sinker ball pitcher. Okay. Get the fastball up. Anything from that the you know from the thigh down. I was trying to take because I didn't want to be chasing that splitter down in the dirt. It didn't work out all that well for me, you know, <laughs> for the most part. I might have had a couple of, you know, walks off of him because, you know, he, he couldn't find the zone there. But every once in a while, you know, I might have hit a ball hard like on that one there. But um, it's just a lot easier said than done because it looks so identical to his fastball. And, I mean, with the amount of strikeouts that he's getting on that splitter, it's unbelievable. I got bad news, Alex. Oh, oh, for 10 with four Ks. <laughs> we, can, we, we, can, we give you the good and the bad, Alex. We, can, we give you the love when the, when the love is appropriate. I, I, but hey, that, that, that's just the truth. I you could know? always count on you, you know, for that. <laughs> Thanks, man. I appreciate that's it. That's just the truth. Uh, but, but think about it. 32, I'm looking at it now, 32 strikeouts on the splitter. Yeah. I mean, that's a lot of swing and miss on a pitch that is not always a strike. But that just shows the deception that he that he creates between the fastball and the splitter. Yeah, and Joel, look, if you're Toronto, and yeah, you did pay over 100 mil for him, but you have to be con uh, encouraged. Plus, Ryu gets healthy here. Alec Manoa has come out to hot. Uh, Barrios has always got the potential to kind of go on a stretch. You, you have your, your game plan coming into the season was your starting rotation was going to be one of your key strengths. You have to be encouraged when you see Gosman doing what he's doing. Yeah, you know, I mentioned the domino fall where the Giants lost Gosman and replaced, replaced him with Rodon, and it's kind of not that far off. How about the Blue Jays lost the AL Cy Young Award yeah, winner yeah. in Robbie Ray and replaced him with the guy who's the AL Cy Young front runner five weeks into the season. That's a pretty good trade also. You mentioned Manoa. Those are the only two guys who are pitching real well in their rotation right now. It's a big deal. Ryu comes off the injured list to start tomorrow.